Stopped off at Sushi Paradise to grab some lunch just down on Grafton Street. Super fresh, um, plenty of filling, so you. Just heading out of Cairns, um, stayed at the NRMA uh, Caravan Park. Um, nice park, um, got a discount with our NRMA. Um, 61.20 for two nights. Um, it is reasonably close to the airport, like I guess everything is close to the airport, so it is a little bit loud. Um, when I first got there and checked in, she was like, oh, you know, make sure everything's locked up at night, blah, blah, blah. Um, and then she was asking about the bike on the roof. Um, and she's like, oh, will it be off? I said, oh, if it's off, I'll, I'll be riding it. And then when I'm done with it, I put it back up. And she's like, oh, like, can you lock it? I'm like, yeah, yeah, you can lock it. Like, the, the bike locks to the carrier and the carrier's locked to the car. She's like, oh, so they can't get through it with um, with bolt cutters. And I was like, no, I don't think so. So that'd be a bit of an effort to climb to the top of my car with bolt cutters to try and cut off a bike carrier to get the bike down. She's like, oh, okay. Because um, we have had quite a bit of, um, you know, people coming through and, and sort of taking stuff. So make sure everything's locked up. Um, so literally any time I would leave, including just going to the toilet block, I would lock the van. <laughs> just in case. Um, Cairns is pretty big. Um, do I like Cairns? Not right now. Um, it is a bit confusing to sort of navigate your way through, including Google Maps. Um, I was trying to get to Woolworths and I ended up at the airport. <laughs> so that was interesting. Um, yeah, so it's I don't know, it's kind of like Shepparton, but like if you take the main strip of Shepparton and then like have it in layers and layers and layers, um, that's pretty much what Cairns is like. Um, and then the closer you get down to the water, you've sort of got all these streets with promenades in between and, and all that. Um, would I come to Cairns? Yes, but I would fly in and just stay somewhere on the promenade and just, you know, eat out, drink out and just sort of do whatever. I wouldn't really come here with a caravan. Um, there's not really a great deal of stuff sort of to do around the area. Um, like I only stayed for two days um, and I'm pretty glad that I'm I'm leaving. Um, but yeah, on my way to, where am I going now? Crystal Creek. Um, which I think is around an hour north of Townsville. Um, so I head there, see how uh, everything is, and um, yeah, go from there. So, yeah, okay, so when I say there isn't a great deal of stuff to do, I mean there isn't a great deal of stuff to do for what I'm doing, like going on day trips and seeing, you know, stuff or whatever. Um, you can pretty much knock over everything there is sort of in the area in a day, maybe two. Um, but there's like a shitload of stuff to do if you're just coming here for a fucking a holiday specifically to here. Like they've got this awesome wake park that I went past. Um, and like, you know, the promenade is pretty cool. Um, I think they've got like a splash park or a pool or I don't know, something down there. Um, so there's a shitload of stuff to do. Um, like if you're staying down the promenade, like you can walk to pretty much everything. There's bars everywhere, there's food everywhere. Really good sushi place um, that I spoke about. Um, but yeah, just caravanning, like I just wouldn't stay. You see people and they've pulled up and they've been here for quite some time. And I just sort of wonder what the fuck they're doing. Like if you're paying, you know, 40 bucks a night for a powered site so you can sit in your caravan all day with your aircon on. Like, what's the point? Um, there are a shitload of um, tourists here traveling around in those little, they're called like spaceships, which is basically like a, um, like a soccer mum car. Um, and then like you sort of make up the bed in the back and you know sort of travel around um, and quite a lot of um, people with hired motorhomes um, but yeah I just don't see it as being you know somewhere that you're gonna want to stop I mean like Cooktown you know you've got a shitload of stuff to do and see you know day trips and that sort of stuff so if you're gonna stay somewhere you'd be you'd rather stay up there um, and just sort of do a, an overnight or maybe two nights max in Cairns you know, top up on all your groceries and that sort of stuff. Um, 
they do have a Costco. Um, I did not go because um, I forgot, so that's a bonus. But yeah, um, so when I say there's not a lot of stuff to do, that's what I mean. You know, for me, there's not a lot of stuff to do. 